What's up Diva fam and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Obviously you can tell by the title down below we are doing another RBSG makeup challenge video. This is the Random Beauty Support Group. I am a part of here on YouTube. It's a bunch of great females that come together to do makeup challenges every single month. Um, the word is auto-generated for us and then is given to one of the lovely ladies in the group and then they kind of figure out what kind of theme or what kind of makeup challenge we end up doing with it. So if you guys have been here before then you know the gist. If you haven't been here before well now you're about to find out the gist. But if you like videos like this, this video a big thumbs up because it helps me out so so much. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel because you know you want to and don't forget to go ahead and hit that notification bell down below so you never miss a video with me, your girl Senior D and let's just go ahead and get into this. Alright, so this is your first time from my YouTube channel. Hello, how are you? I love you guys to be a part of the hashtag Diva Fam. I post videos over here two to three times a week. I also post on Instagram, TikTok, all different social medias. It is Sandra D Beauty 01 across all of them. Love you guys to be a part of this YouTube channel because again, it's beauty, makeup, and lifestyle videos. I also do giveaways once a month. There is a giveaway coming up here shortly. Um, it should already be probably the next video after this one before the month ends. I promise. I promise. Um, but yes, I will be doing... Ugh, why is this falling down? Don't mind. I have an outfit that goes with this anyways. So let's go ahead and jump into this video. Um, and let me talk about what the actual word is for this month. So for those of you who have been here before and those of you who have it, we kind of, like I said, it is a random word that is generated this month. The word is chorus and it went to our girl Lin, Lin So her thoughts on this were, hey everyone, I hope everyone's having a great Wednesday. So I'm thinking for chorus, it makes me think of musicals. So a look inspired by your favorite musical. It can be the colors that you think of when you watch the musical, cool, or, or looks from one of your characters in the musical. So that is pretty much it is what she gave us. So when I thought of this, I thought of my, one of my favorite musicals that came out recently, more or less like Broadway-esque in a sense of it all, but kind of tied together. I love Chicago, I love Moulin Rouge, and I love burlesque. So I kind of went with burlesque instead because Christina Aguilera was my girl in this movie. I know some people, unpopular opinions, some people love it, some people don't love it, but I loved it so much, especially, you know, Cher was in there. Um, and so was, oh my god, why am I drawing Kristen Bell? And, oh my god, what's the other girl? She's literally sitting on top of my tongue from Dancing with the Stars. You guys know exactly what I'm talking about. But anyways, realistically, the three leads were uh, Kristen Bell, Christina Aguilera, and Cher. So, without further ado, we're going to do some makeup that is inspired by it. So, let's just go ahead and jump into this. I already had went ahead and did my base, um, so this video wouldn't be so long. Clipped my hair back. Then, the foundation I went with, obviously we know sometimes when it comes to like... Broadway, musicals, and things like that, we have to have full coverage. We have to make sure this makeup stays. So one of my favorite, um, Airbrush Flawless Foundation by Charlotte Tilbury. Love this so much. I'm in the shade 3 Neutral, which is that one right there. Um, and then the other two items I went ahead and used for a primer is the Stila One Step Correct. This is a skin tone correcting brightening primer. I love this, but I feel like you don't get enough product in here because look at this. Do you see this already? But that's not where it started because do you see the thick, the, the thick stopper at the bottom? So think about it when it's already here. Like, there's not as much product as you actually think there is. Um, a little kind of goes a long way. I do two pumps. Maybe two pumps is too much, but it, like, helps moisturize the skin at the same time. Then I went with the Stay Naked Correcting 24-Hour Concealer. This is in 10 double N. This is what it is. Very brightening underneath the eyes. And then for powder, I went already in with the Fenty Beauty Powder. So, without further ado, we're going to keep going on with this makeup. I'm going to go ahead and bronze and do some contouring. Because um, I definitely think that's something that needs to be done with this face. Now, obviously, when it comes to my inspo, that's more of really simple makeup at the same time, too. Um, bright red lip, you know, big wing, um, you know, that whole entire... If I can find a, fit, a like a photo inspo, I'll put it here for you guys. But let's just go ahead and keep going in. Next, I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of cream contour on my face. I'm going in with the Iconic London... Um, multi sculpting contour palette. I'm gonna go in with my favorite brush right here. This is the Morphe E63. Um, and just lightly tap in there just so I can get that. And like I said, a little goes a long way when you tap into this. I kid not. Next, going in with my brows. That's easy enough.
All right, next I'm going in with the one size rosebud. Again, it's a little bit more about the blush too at the same time. So I'm gonna just take my normal one. I'm just gonna go ahead and just do powder, not the cream and the powder together. Placing it on the high points of my cheeks. All right, I'm gonna set in all the powder products so far using the e.l.f. Stay All Night. And while that's wet, I'm gonna go in with my favorite blinding highlighter. This is uh, Rodeo Drive by Ofra. It's so beautiful. Like, do you see that? All right, so the eyes are gonna be really simple. I'm using my favorite e.l.f. made or made for matte um, eyeshadow palette. I'm gonna go in with this like neutral shade here. We're gonna put like a deep brown here in our crease and then the wing, then the wing. Okay, going in with a neutral brown in the crease. A little bit of dark brown on the outer corner. And now time for the winged eyeliner, my least favorite part um, that gets me every time. This is the Joa Line Up Liquid Eyeliner, the waterproof one. Um, it does have like a felt tip to it. Okay, so this is my least favorite part is making the wing because I have slightly hooded eyes and for some reason it always drags on this side um, and because I also have my scar, I don't know, I just feel like it's so weird on this side compared to the other side. Pray for me that I can do this one the same on the other side. See, this side just goes on so much more easier than this one does. And I think it's because I have more like eye wrinkles on this side. I don't know. It just never, never goes the way that I want it to, ever. Okay, we're going to do a little bit of mascara and then the lashes and the lips and then the outfit and we're done. Also, the mascara I'm using, you guys have seen me use this a million times, is the Essence Lash Princess. I love what it does for my bottom lashes. Um, also, I love what it does for my top lashes when I have mixed that with a different one. Okay. So that's that. I'm going to put on lashes and I'll be right. All right, so I am back and this is the finish makeup look. As you can see, um, eyelashes are on. I went ahead and used the Ioni 3D Faux Mink Lashes, the well-rounded ones, which you can see these lashes are definitely lifting to the gods. I went in with the NYX Shine Aloud on a mission, and then as you can see, I kind of went in with some pearls, some, you know, a little bit of a corset top, since that's kind of like all the rage for these young girls these days, but your girl has too big of boobs, and I feel like I'm spilling out of this thing. I've had this for a very long time, though. I've had this since I was like in my 20s, um, this thing does not fit the same way that it did when I was in my 20s, so there is that. Um, but yeah, that is the end for this video. So how do you guys think I did on the whole burlesque look that went along with the word chorus? I, I like it, I love it, but I want to get out of this because A, this corset is like not fitting me right, and B, I just feel a little bit out there on the internet, so... Anyways, I love you guys so, so much, so you know the gist. If you like videos like this, this video, a big thumbs up because it helps me out so, so much. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel because you know you want to. And don't forget to go ahead and hit that notification bell down below so you never miss a video with me, your girl, Senior D. 
and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to go ahead and check out the playlist down below for all the other girls that are part of this RBS Jeans Random Beauty Support Group, the makeup challenge videos. Trust me, you're not going to want to miss it because I'm definitely curious to see what musicals these girls chose. So anyways, thank you guys so, so much. Bye. And boy, I believe in us. I am terrified to love for the first time. Can't you see it? I'm bound to change. I finally found my way. I am bound to you. I am bound. Suddenly, the moment. Oh my god, I haven't tried this song in so long. This is cold turkey, okay? I'm sorry. I did what I did. Bye.